I'm gonna start out with a half an inch MDF sheet usually comes in four feet by eight feet I'm gonna put down a few measurements how big I want the house to be so I have the sides here I have the measurements right here the length is 73 inches by 24 inches and then over here I have a, a door a long window on the top and a window on this side this window is 9 inches by 13 inches the top window is gonna be five and a half inches by 32 inches and the doors are gonna be 12 and a half inches by 7 inches and this front is gonna be 16 inches so one side is 16 inches and the other side is going to be 25 inches Use this jigsaw to cut open all the windows and the door. I'm gonna start painting everything white. I'm gonna use this air compressor, not to be used by children. I'm gonna measure the door now. piece of plexiglass that I'm gonna cut and this piece is gonna go on the top all the way across and I also have some white outside corners that look like this in longer strips you can get them from the hardware store I'm gonna measure and put those white outside corners on all the sides you 
you can also cut the white outside corners with uh, siding pliers. I prefer to cut them on this one because it gives me a straight, straight line. Remove the protection coat on both sides on the plexiglass. Now I'm gonna do the same for this window, mini hinges and a few screws in here. Just gonna measure where I want the hinges to be. I'm gonna use this electrical sander. this kind of hook up Now I'm going to do the same thing as I did with the plexiglass and the white outside corners. And then I have the flooring down, just to make sure that you give your door enough space to close and open. These ones I got from the hardware store. They come in 
four by eight feet and I'm gonna put this on the outside of the house and I'm gonna probably take three of those stone sections here and I'm gonna cut it with a table saw Here I have some white outside plastic corners. Okay, and here I have some stick on both sides. I got them from the dollar store. And I'm gonna put some on here. And they have a peel and stick sticker in the back here but I'm gonna secure it even more with some hot glue and then the other one is gonna come on the other side and then I'm gonna do the same step on the other side And when you want to play, you just remove it. And for the roof, I just have like a really thin piece of wood. So it's not as heavy when you want to take off the roof. And then right here, I have a long piece of wood so I can hang it on to the other side of the house and it's not gonna fall or shift I figured if I'm gonna use real shingles it's gonna get even heavier so why not just paint it and then it's like easier to take the roof down and on if you want to play with it This one doesn't open because this is the wall where when you want to play you just take the wall off. kitchen, dining area, 